Hey, happy weekend, messy gang. What's popping, everybody? To go drizzy. Welcome back to Drizzy Radio. Get a cup of tea. Let's jump straight into this mess. Well, today's topic we're going about Hamisa Mobeto and what happened during the week. Well, for those who don't know, Hamisa Mobeto attended some uh, Tanzanian award and people were taking photos of her, including bloggers and media houses. And Hamisa Mobeto was looking so good in this green dress, honey, and her makeup was on point. But one thing I don't understand is why Wasafi Media decided to edit the color of the dress and also edit, okay, make Amisa Mobeto's makeup look so bad, honey. If this is not hate, then I don't know what this is, okay? It's so obvious that Hamisa was looking so good in this dress and they manipulated the camera or rather the color of what now and make it seems like a Mesa Wobeto, you know, use uh, editing and stuff. Because a Mesa has been accused so many times of editing her videos. I don't understand why people kept on saying that because it's obvious when she was, uh, recently she was in Nairobi and she went on Nation uh, Media and she just looked the same. I didn't see even anything different about her, okay? And I don't understand why such a big media like Wasafi would do her like that, okay? Hamisa took to her Instagram and also, you know, talk like she was clapping back at those people and saying that for those who want to continue hate her, she just continue hating her. She will be winning regardless. And... Uh, I don't know why all this um, hate on Hamisa is coming from. I could say that, you know, it's more like what uh, Tanasha Donna is going with Kenyan blogs and medias right here in Kenya is exactly what Hamisa is going through in Tanzania because someone will come up and make up so many lies about Hamisa and uh, bloggers will Speak it like that. What? But whenever Amisa is doing anything positive, nobody is reporting that. Okay, and they rarely post that. Okay, and whenever Hamisa done anything or any negativity, they will run with the story like wildfire. Okay, as you can see right here, this is bullying. This is this is not acceptable. Okay, and also Amisa Mubeto a couple of minutes ago posted these nice, beautiful pictures, and she post she with the caption. Um, different something like that okay and i thought that she has embraced you know she's been bullied for a minute no, ever since she was associated with diamond i don't think there's a time where hamisa has gone without being dragged okay with this uh big uh fan pages and all these media houses she's used to it by now she is like i'm going to have fun with y'all I will determine when and how to trend. Just like Diamond has done it. I mean, I've learned it from Diamond, you know. She can, you know, she knows how to make her name pop in. And uh, she, at this point, she doesn't care. I wish that Tanasha will adapt that. Or whenever we, negativity are too much, it shouldn't affect her. Because Amisa, uh, Tanasha hasn't been here for long than Amisa. Whenever they talk shit about her, she should just embrace that and be like, I don't care. She should just do her thing without caring what other people will say. Because at the end of the day, whether you do good or bad, they will still talk. They will still find negativity to talk about you. So I think Miss Mama should just be out here loving her man and continuing to shine like he is. But shame on you, Asafi, for what you did to her. Miss Amobeto, this is wrong at any level i just hope that mr sadala didn't put you into this anyway keep it classy stay messy let's meet up on the comment section i love you to the moon and back at you